Happy Victory Friday, Ravens flock. We're fresh off the 34-20 win over the Cincinnati Bengals on Thursday night football. The Ravens are back in the win column and have now extended their lead in the AFC North standings. Gus Edwards continued his domination in the run game last night with 12 carries for 62 yards and two touchdowns, extending his streak to five straight games of finding the end zone. Last night was also Gus the Bus's third game this season with two or more rushing touchdowns, which is now tied for second most in a single season for the Baltimore Ravens. To put just how good the bus has been into perspective, since week seven, Gus has nine rushing touchdowns. Every other team in the NFL has six or fewer. Gus also now ranks second in the NFL in rushing touchdowns with 10, which is more than all pro running back Christian McCaffrey. And the Ravens lead the league in rushing yards and touchdowns. Edwards has already exceeded his previous career high for touchdowns in a season, which was six in 2020. Right now at 11 games into the season, Gus has nearly 600 rushing yards and 10 touchdowns. And while those are the numbers showing up on the stat sheets, Edwards credits his O-line for the success he's having in the red zone. Like I said, I feel like we're playing good football. You know, we're playing great balance. Um, the run game is coming together. Um, we've been putting a lot of emphasis on that red zone and how we have to get points there. And um, everybody's been coming together and making it making it a must a must thing. You know, second half we opened it up a little bit, so that's just you got to keep you got to keep pounding, keep smashing in there, and our guys are blocking hard and. It opened up for him. It's been great to see Gus step up this year as the starting running back after J.K. Dobbins' season-ending injury in week one. Being able to rely on Edwards to power his way in for six has been a crucial part of Todd Munkin's offense. And as we've seen this season, it's very difficult for defenses to stop the bus when it gets rolling. Before I go, I did want to mention we actually had Gus mic'd up for last night's primetime game at the bank. And do we agree with Keaton Mitchell? Does the bus need a touchdown dance? Yeah! Let's go! Oh! I don't dance. I don't dance. Okay, so they want me to dance so bad. You at the club. I'm not dancing from the goal line, bro. Gus Mike Dup will be part of our next Wired episode, which will drop next Wednesday night at 8 p.m. So make sure you check that out and hear more of what he had to say during his two touchdown performance under the lights. That's it for me today on Final Drive. Have a great weekend, and we'll see you again next week.